terrible night's sleep. I was up all night trying to come up with a way to beat all these out of that quarter that you got to pay just to get a shopping cart, man. I ain't never heard of such a thing. Maybe they're mad at me because I leave the cart out in the middle of the parking lot. I don't know. And if that ain't bad enough, you got to buy the bags. I refused. I pulled my shirt out and I put all my stuff in my shirt and I carried it out like this, man. Imagine the nerve of them people. Ha! I inject sarcastic humor in almost every video I do and it amazes me. It just amazes me how many people fall for it. I love it. <laughs> I know you can get the quarterback. I know that. And I know you got to bring your own bags or buy the one. I have those bags. Yeah, I love all these, man. And I got burned last week by my local grocery store. Go figure. The Monopoly in town. And I vow I will never go back for meat again. It's the second time I got burned on meat there. The first time was the bad chicken. I will never eat chicken again. I didn't like it much in the first place. But ever since then, I just, uh, any taste for chicken whatsoever, however it's cooked, I will never probably ever eat chicken again. It was that bad. And I didn't do nothing about it. But I bought some ribeyes there last week, not at Aldi's, at the local grocery store. They were $7 a piece. They were $14. They were in a pack of two. All right. They looked all right. They looked a little thin, but they looked all right. Well... The packaging was deceiving because when I opened them things up, they were like this thin. They were like little flank steaks. You know, the cheap dollar ten steaks you buy that you put in fajitas. That's what they were like, man. Oh, I was so mad. So I vowed right then and there that I will do the hour drive once a week, which I usually do for, do for the canned dog food anyway. And I will put my electric cooler in the back of my truck and it'll stay in there all summer and I will get my meats at Aldi's and so I went the other day and I got about hundred and thirteen dollars worth of meat let me tell you I got a lot of meat I got salmon I got steaks I got ground beef uh, about 30 pounds of meat at least 30 pounds of meat so I will be doing that that store in town has lost my business I may go in there for if I need tin foil or I need something small, but I will not buy food there ever again because I'm already going an hour away to get dog food. I might as well go to Aldi's. It wasn't that big of a stretch to go there. They do have good meat too. Uh, that's another thing about the local store. Their meat was terrible and it comes from Mexico. Uh, that's what it said on most of the labels. Who knows what goes on there? Don't know. But it is funny that even though I said, I know you can get your quarterback, somebody is going to probably post a comment saying, you know you can get your quarterback. You got to put the key back in and it'll pop out. Somebody's going to do it. It's, it's, it's crazy. You know what else gets me? I had, to, I oh, uh, yesterday, you know, some of the comments, guys, you don't see. You ain't going to see them uh, because they're, People are just, uh, and I give people the benefit of the doubt sometimes. But I had a comment stating, you don't do nothing no more. You just, you just sit here and talk. What happened to you building and doing things? Well, you're on the wrong channel. Okay? I don't know how clear I can make it that I swapped. That's all I did. Was we'll swap the names of the channel, yet people don't get that. I understand somebody may not have watched my channel for a while or missed that video. I can understand that. But to sit there and chastise me for not doing this, not finishing this project, not finishing that project, I don't have to finish any of my projects. I don't. If I don't want to finish any of them, I won't finish any of them. I film what I film. I probably won't film any more building projects. You know, if that's how it's going to go. But it amazes me. I don't know. I don't know how any other way to say it. I know it was a mistake to change the names. That created so much confusion. I haven't lost any subs on the other channel. So obviously those people understand or they're still there. 
I don't want, I don't get it, but I wouldn't recommend anybody do what I did and swap the names. Uh, I probably did lose some people because of that. But this is the podcast talk channel. That's what I do here. I'm not being lazy and not doing anything. This is what this channel is for. And that's it. But I have put videos on this channel. I will put videos on this channel. Not as often as I do these. But this is the podcast channel. Whatever you want to call it. I don't know. Currently for this, I'm trying. I ordered these. Because they say, I don't like the sound of these. Okay, you watch other podcasts and they sound really, really good and clear. And, you know, DJI mics and Rode mics are good. But you don't get that. And I, and I got the mic. I got all this stuff, man. I got to figure out how to work it. I think I have to hook up my webcam, which is, does not have the quality that this camera does. So if I can mingle all these together... You know, where are my headphones when I look more important? Huh? So I have the items to make them sound better. Uh, I like the microphone that Radio Jonesy, if you guys have ever watched his channel. Man, that one sounds good. You know, but and this one, this is a Blue Eddy. It's not a cheap mic. And I can't find the cord for it. It's one of them that has the special one here, not the USB-C. It has the special one, and I and I can't find it. When I moved from the other office to here, I lost some of that stuff. I tore this place up looking for this microphone's cord, and I can't even find one on Amazon. I have not found the Blue Eddy. Uh, is that what it's called? Blue Yeti. One of them, something like that. I can't find the cord. So without the cord, it's worthless. So I'm trying to improve on it here. Uh, I, I realize that this camera here that I'm using is turned around. And so if you're reading any of these signs back here that they're backwards, that's just how this DJI is. It's the Pocket 3. That's how it is. If I turn it around, then I can't tell if I'm in the screen or not. Uh, so I need to figure that out. Now the ones I've made out in the patio, I did have it turned around. But there is a, a DJI app that you put on your phone and, and it'll have the screen on there where I can see what's going on. But the app went bad and I, for the life of me, cannot... And you go to their website. It says you have to go to their website because the, the app stores don't have it. And that's how I got it originally, and now I just cannot download it from there. So I'm trying, but it's all these technical things, you know. And I understand you can hear me, but it's just not the sound that I want. Uh, I had already gotten up, made a whole different video on some other subject, and decided not to put it up. Uh, it's a challenge every day to come up with something, but we get it done. And like I said, I may not do this every day. I wasn't even going to put one up today, but here we are. So hopefully we can get the. Now these things are cool. Uh, I'm not much of a headphone person, but these are Bluetooth. I can pick up my Amazon Music on that if I'm out mowing. These are going to be great. I haven't tried them yet, but I can watch my TV, put these on, uh, and not disturb Rooster because you know some of these channels that I watch, she don't she don't like. So. But if Rooster starts talking to me, I'm not going to hear her with these on. You know, you can't win. Either way, you don't win. So, I just haven't put much on the other channel. I just, I don't have anything. When it starts heating up and getting hot, which it really isn't hot yet. Uh, but I've got other things going on, so I haven't been putting any videos up there. I don't want to put nonsense on there. Uh, as far as working on anything nope i've been i have not done any of that when i do they'll be up there um uh, i should be working on the kitchen but i done cleaned up out there all the wood i put all the tools back in the shed and i just didn't feel like and and it's storming every single day here almost so i don't want to drag all that stuff out and have to cover it in tarps even though i have the carport it still gets wet in there, so I don't want to drag everything out just to have to put it back up. 
So I've kind of haven't done anything there. It's not that I'm lazy and I have had other things going on where I have to leave and take care of things. We are human beings just like you. There's times in our lives we've got other things going on that are way more important than putting up a video on YouTube. The channel isn't going anywhere. So watch someone else until I put a video up. That's all I can say. Some people put videos up every day where they're driving or talking and, you know, they're not interesting. I don't want to do that anymore. You know, I've never really done the driving, talking thing unless I was going somewhere and the rest of the video had some content. But just a plain driving, talking video, I don't like doing those. Uh, anybody else can do them if they want. I don't want to do them. So I hope everybody has a safe weekend. Uh, it's Memorial Day weekend. There's something I want to say. Do not confuse Memorial Day weekend with Veterans Day. People, a lot of people come up and or they'll get on Facebook and thank you. And hey, that's good, but it's not my holiday. Memorial Day is for the fallen. The veterans who have lost their lives uh, that are no longer with us. That is their day. That's why it's called Memorial it's a memorial to them. Uh, veterans, it has nothing to do with the current day veterans. Although you could still thank them, it is not their holiday. Veterans Day, on the other hand, is. So that has always been confusing to people. Uh, so now you know. If you didn't know, you know. And I know a lot of people watch that are not in the United States. It's, it's a holiday that America has once a year to honor the service members who have passed on. And I'm sure your country, Canada, Australia, whatever, probably has the same. Probably not the same day, but has the same. I know Canada and the United States celebrate a lot of simultaneous uh, holidays. Um, but that is just one we have. There are many others that, you know, it's like every month now there's a holiday. <laughs> uh, yeah. But a lot of tornadoes have been going on. It's, man, it's It's bad. And I don't think, I don't think there's more tornadoes now. I think they're just more covered. Everybody has a camera. There are channels that do nothing but cover those things. So I think that is why we think there's more of them. When in fact there isn't. Uh, because they're being covered. Uh, I hope I don't ever have to cover one. But you know if one comes down a road, I'm going to be out there filming it just how I am. It's how I grew up, man. It's the way it is. All right, guys, it's already too long, but uh, if you know how to beat all these out of that quarter, let me know. I've tried the slugs, everything. Nothing works, man. I love that store, though. I'll be going there every week. The meat is good. It is, and it's it's the price is good. Thanks for watching. Happy Trails. Battery's almost dead on this camera.